Hello, it is Jason Trina, and welcome back to Planet Coaster. So, I'm looking at our little park management screen here, and a very general thing is people want more rides. A lot of them, please. So, I'd love to build a coaster for them, but we're not doing that right now. <laughs> so, in between that last episode, I just kind of put another area down, plopped in the garden in. Same one as before, the blueprint one. Just kind of keep it looking nice, get the scenery rating up. We have decent scenery rating. A little intro to the park that we did last episode, and I just went into the tunnel. There that is. I was looking last after last episode, and I couldn't see this little dotted line that shows you where the edge of your park is, which I really wish you could expand, but I don't think you can. Really upsetting. Um, Alright, so if we go back over here, we're going to go ahead and put in some... I'm zooming in and out really fast, and I'm sorry about that. A little... little don't know why a little hyper... 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 Which is always good. Alright, I want an ATM. ATMs are useful. Um... And, all right, I'm gonna start working on track rides. But I don't think we're making enough profit to do that. So we'll just so we're gonna put some shops right here. There's the plan, a line of shops, probably all in one building, and then we'll have a first aid building or something like that there. Oh, this is custom. So these are our options. I love that this actually just isn't really used anymore in the game. You see, I don't know what you, <laughs> I don't know what you would do there. It's mainly because this used to be a part of the game that you would have, you would actually have to create this part in to connect a cue path to a normal path, and they just kind of made it part of the cue path, like right there. Oh, it's normal, but like right here. See, it's a very similar concept, it's just the way it looks. Okay, so, never mind about that. If we go, alright, what do we want to put next door to the bathroom? Basically everything else here really isn't as popular, I would say. I actually kind of want to do another one of those buildings right there instead. I might look a little better, maybe put the first aid on one building down. Um, so yeah, we'll put a Cosmic Cow Ice Cream and a Hot Dog Squad. Basically what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this entire building and we're just going to redo it to look... Yeah, so this isn't that too difficult of a build to be honest. I'll go ahead and plop down the Cosmic Cow Ice Cream make it face towards the street, and plop down a hot dog squad next door. Um, and we'll do a thing. I've already forgotten what I was doing. Okay, I remember now. <laughs> wow. Okay, so bu building set. Building set. Okay. Um, we'll go to walls. And we'll plop down some walls, you know? Oh, hello. I didn't hit tab there. Thank you, computer, for being as buggy as usual. This is what happens when I build my own computer. I randomize knowledge, and it can mess up some things. Easily. Alright, so we'll have those down there, and... Pop you, and you... I'm just doing this really quick, because the design is relatively simple, so it's not that hard. Which is basically what relatively simple means. Alright, that goes there. That goes there. And we'll go and slap on the roofing segments of this and this. Oh, we didn't actually edge it there. We kind of did. We put it underneath it. And that's interesting. Whatever, we'll do something like that again. Uh, proofs, uh, um, that was in English. Okay. Just me kind of thinking everything through as I go, which is really fast. I just want to get this bit done really f as fast as possible. Pull up. Pull up. That doesn't look right now. It's because it's not. It's here and here. And same thing on this side. And there's one last segment that goes up. Which is this guy. And this guy. Nice. So that's more or less done. It just needs that little bit of scenery that the other ones have. So it's all reset filters. So Cosmic Cow Ice Cream. That's Cosmic Ice Cream Wall Sign 2. Lit. Alright. That's Milkshakes. It says ice cream. I'm not seeing this problem. Wait, this is supposed to be ice cream. Wait. Um, that one's ice cream. Do we have like one like this? No, it's just really big. I just want to. I want this. This just calls them call ice cream. No, this says milkshakes. No, this one belongs here. Yeah, those are the same. I guess this is the lit version? No, it's just... What? 
lots of milkshakes. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take one of these guys. It doesn't seem to fit on there quite well, and we're just gonna bring it out just a tad there. And we'll put a thing on it that makes it light, even though it's not a lit one. Just that's how we're gonna do it. And then the other one's hot dog squad. Hot dog, no. Hot dog sign. Oh, I accidentally hit D. That, that's funny. Okay. Hot dog squad. Okay, and we'll go ahead and clear that. What we want? Oh, that, 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 awning. So, Cosmic High Ice Cream. This one is actually ice cream. Alright, and then we want Hot Dog Squad here. And then we're gonna get some lighting on it. This type of lighting. So, I'm gonna figure out how to do that in a moment. Get these guys in as before, so there can be a little bit of lighting in here. Because I actually took some time earlier to see how it looked at night, because I was curious. I, I was just curious what they were using. <laughs> um, put that there. Okay, cool. So the building's more or less done. I want to do this with both, build both, both buildings. So, it's a little swinging sign. Cosmic Cow ice cream, not milkshakes. And hot dog squad should be somewhere nearby. Here we are. I think it's just a nice little touch. Go over to milkshakes. Cosmic cow milkshakes. And then chief beef. Little swing signs. I think they're a nice little touch. They're cute. Um, anything else? Anything I am... Oh, we need to light that sign. I pointed at it with my finger where you couldn't see that. Um, go away. I want the up light, which is under the building tab. Uh, light. Little up lights. And then I have to make sure I angle them correctly because I always get it wrong. Do one like that. <laughs> We're doing the up light sideways. One like that. That should theoretically get it lit. So let's see at night. PM. Uh, it's good enough. It's seeable from a distance. Okay, cool. So back today, please. Okay, so we've done that little building. A little bit more food. Nifty, as usual. So over here, we're going to want to build our first coaster of sorts. It will be just this type of coaster here. The, that one. We don't have much money to do it with at the moment, so we're going to turn back on time. I'm probably going to lose money. Yeah, because I don't. we're not going to make a profit with these guys yet. They're fairly new and they're out distance. So this person's running there. They're keen, kind of. No, they're wandering. They're, they're heading towards it. Or not. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna place down some things. We are actually... Are we at 348 or 248? I don't remember. I don't lose too much money. Alright, I'm gonna quickly place... While we're here, I'm gonna place one of these. Just a bit in between. I want it to be kind of central. No? Can I? No, I can't. It's, they're so hard to work with. I'll place it there. And I'll do the same thing over here. It's just like a little bit in front. But kind of conveniently close. Right, I think I'm still making a profit, even with these guys open. And this seems to be interesting. I'm going to close them for now. So I'm not spending money to have them open. I should theoretically shoot up my profits. Or not. I don't know. So we're going to go ahead and uh, coaster, please. Move one of these guys, Looney Tunes ride. Um, we're gonna rotate it. I actually don't know how I'm gonna go about starting this ride. Um, the exit will immediately exit down. I'm fine with that. And the entrance can be on the other side. We'll figure out how that works later. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. I, I can't decide how to start it. No, I want it to be a through ride though, like that. Okay, so it's gonna start about should actually be in more than enough space. Place it there. I actually want to go the other direction, please. And we're going to bring it down. Put a little rotation on it. Well, it's going to go immediately into a chain lift, I think, is the plan. Yeah, that will be the plan. Chain lift immediately. I'd like to have a testing while I'm doing this. And I'm going to set the speed up to 14, just so it can go up the chain lift fast. Get a bit of angling. Just get it up really quick and fast. 
because yeah all right that's already too tall or i just don't have enough money yeah i just don't have enough money Ooh. 96 dollars okay we have money i'm gonna speed up time just so we can get money quickly do 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 drop off these should be cheaper theoretically they are quite significantly I think it's immediately just gonna drop into like a spiral sort of thing. I don't know. Ooh, we have like, we made loops and stuff. Time liner, no. Dive loop, no. I flip down. I like that. Although it needs to angle slightly. No. Uh, uh, Norwegian's fun. Just I don't think it would have enough speed to do it. Yeah. You know, the inclined eighty. You probably want to go down. Press loop again, very fun. Don't have enough speed. Rolls, what rolls do we have? We have the dive drop. That one's kind of fun. I don't think we'd be going fast enough for that to be interesting. But we might actually, we have the hammerhead, no, that goes up. I'm just kind of like testing different things to see what works better, you know? Bow tie, because it's cool. Bananas. Um, all right, let's, 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 let's do a, Dive drop. Dive drop. That doesn't change the direction it comes out. It does slightly. So we'll each weigh a 449, which will be just a moment, I'm sure. Or am I losing money? I'm losing money. No, that's not okay. Businesses really aren't making much money, are they? Kind of like walking past. <laughs> Um, let's see. Oh, I can almost have that. Park management is going to cost me a decent amount because, you know, we're researching and we have staff. Which I want to fire a mechanic, but I should not. I'm going to pay, I'm going to pay them a little bit less. Not the best choice in the world to do, but it is going to be what I do. They aren't already, right, I'm going to lower the pricing of the payment of these guys to like 140. They're going to hate me. Or them aren't even working. Uh, you work here. Are you? You work. I would immediately hire someone new. That's annoying. Okay. Go back to editing you because I think we have enough. Yeah, we have more. Than we have about enough. We'll go ahead and put a roll in that goes down. We want it to go out right. We can have some fun with it, of course. Need a little bit of a curve going on. I'm gonna, all right. So we'll pull it a little bit to the left. Okay. I'm curious what the rating is. All right, so that's definitely gonna be a problem there. So we have that ride. That's just some sufficient funds. Alright, let's see how it does. It's more or less green, stays green. That's always good. This is gonna be a thing where I have to sit and make money. That's actually very annoying. And we will need a lot of it in order to build this. It's a cool looking coaster at the moment though. Kind of. I like how it cuts back in on itself and uses the same supports as before. No, it builds a whole other set of supports. Never mind. That's stupid. Why doesn't it just use the pre-made one that exists? <sighs> stupid coaster. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get that for a while, so let's speed up time. Uh, is there something else we can do in the meantime? So most the problem is. All right, I can turn up the price of this though. It's like eleven. The price of you as well. Probably. Yeah. Seven. I'll make a little bit more money. It's so fun. Uh, or not. I'm losing more money. It's costing me a lot. Uh, let's reveal the research as well. What's costing us so much in park management? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to close the two businesses. I meant not close. I'm going to delete them. Alright. I'm going to edit the building and I'm going to just delete the business. Both of them. We don't have to pay for the employee. That's going to save us a ton of money. 
Yeah. And they'll just kind of exist there. Uh, wait, do these cost me operating costs? Like lights and stuff? No. Okay, cool. I don't have to pay the operating costs of those employees. Stuff. There, we have to pay for them to exist in our park. Which will get us more money. I'm just glad you don't have to pay employees like this. Because, yeah, they exist. And I still love how this park looks. I would say they're going out on the left and in on the right. They're doing both. I really wish you could have like a one way park entrance and exit. I think there needs to be a garbage can out here. So this guy can throw his garbage. I don't have a thing. Oh, I'm very negative. Is one of my rides broken down? I think this broke down. And the mechanic immediately fixed it. Good mechanic. And you it loses a lot of money when a ride breaks down. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have it check on every ten minutes. And the same thing with this one, just uh keep it just keep it snapping. And actually this is never broken down, so I'll actually keep it at every thirty. But this is broken down quite a bit. That's gonna be. It's a large source of money at the very moment, because it has such a high price. Oh, increased park entry too. I've seen bigger parks. Yeah, I know. I I want that. So any missed sales? Yeah. So I'm not gonna increase the price at all. Give it. Wait. I see something. Okay, I thought they were coming through and going back. So they could have been facing the wrong way, and that's easily a possibility. I've just been wasting time. Alright, we're back at the coaster. Let's go ahead and just... I don't know. I'm trying to think this through. I want to see how it deals with the turn. Alright, let's see the values. Oh, it's a very slow beginning there. Nausea and fear, really high up there at the beginning. Might redo that part, because it's a little bit thick. But these segments, I'm gonna just kinda. It's gonna go up straight a little bit here. And then it's gonna drop. We're gonna keep that little bit of turn going because I want it to drop in this direction. Do more of a gentle drop. And we're gonna drop it down a little bit more. And we're going to probably put a loop on, because loops are fun. That's too big of a loop, I think. Way too big of a loop. That could probably work. Um, dive loops are also fun. Well, let's see if we can do a dive loop. Curious. Just barely not. Okay, if we took another one down and tried doing a lot dive loop. Probably work. I want to go right. Alright, let's see it go down the drop. Speed it up till it gets to the top. Alright. I hate how slow that beginning bit is. But it looks really cool too. So, it comes on down. Speeds around the corner. Probably oh, can smooth that up a little bit. Fear and nausea through the roof. Alright, we're just gonna. Gently bring it back up. Probably go in another loop of some sort, because loops are fun, aren't they? Don't have enough for any of these. A classic vertical loop would probably be fine. Actually, we lowered the size of it a little bit. 412. Be back up time. We'll be right back once we have that much money. Of course. Things.
So I thought while waiting, we could probably smoothen this up a little bit, make it a little bit more nice for the cart. So we'll smooth it. That's just one segment. Smooth this bit. Because it doesn't cost much to do that at all. Especially things like that. That's a mess. Let me also take this back a little bit. Smooth there. Smooth baking. Into this sort of stuff. Smoothen. Yeah. We have enough to put in that loop that we wanted to do. We're just a kind of dive loop. We already have one of those. Where's just a normal roll? That's a sidewinder. Which is what we're already at. Um, where is it? It's just a loop that I'm looking for. Here it is, vertical loop. And we'll shrink it a bit so we make sure we have enough speed, like there. And I'm going to go ahead and stick, I think this only needs about three carts on it, so we're going to go ahead and put like, three station segments. It cost me 240 a piece. My god. I need to wait till we can get another one of those. We're losing money. Wow. We have not seem to turn a profit in this place, now can we? It's like... People are enjoying the rides, and they're purchasing food, high scenery, going to the bathroom. Hmm. Well, I can afford the piece now. I think that'll give us about three. That's really bad. Like, that would be really bad. I think we'll kind of just level it out a little bit, you know? You know, like a turn segment here. Get started gentle. Or we can actually always pull a loop to the left. I want a smaller loop to the left. That. I'm gonna go bigger. Oh, we should have enough speed to do that. 529. I just feel like that's the best way to increase excitement while still maintaining speed and going in a different direction. So. Always a good way to go is with a loop. Definitely. We have to wait till we can afford it, of course, which is always a problem. The problem early game, I guess, is just a lot of waiting for money. Look at how our loan's doing. We're almost there. Can I lower that? Oh, I can. We'll turn more profit. Time being. Anything else I can do to earn more profit? These two are really upset. It's fine. I guess it really isn't though. Send both 150. It's 20 more I'm spending, but their happiness was really low. I just I had a feeling they weren't working as well. They couldn't sell as much. I don't I, I don't know how that works. I'm just assuming there. So back to editing the track, we'll stick that sidewinder on or whatever it was called. Find dive loop. That's right? Yeah. So it'll come on out of there. We'll pull a quick little turn on it. it has a trim. Brake. We'll get rid of the trim brake. I'll do 48, which I can't afford. I'm apparently looks like I'm losing money. A little bit. And we'll strain it out. Maybe put a little hill. Have a place for the track to come uh the the Q path to come through. Wow that actually puts it really far away. Really long Q. Alright, come on. Wanna let me do it? It's only forty eight. Can afford it. I kind of want to auto-complete that. Doesn't seem like the best choice of option. But I'm going to go with it. It'll keep some interest. Actually, if we just stream to a drop here, I think that might be more interesting.
It's inf insufficient funds. 48, please, and then I'll, I'll auto-complete the rest. Come on, just need to make a little bit of money. And then, yeah, I'll complete that part. Wait till we have enough money. And then I'd like to change it to drive tires and put a little bit of brakes or something. I don't know. It's not slamming into the station. So let's also run a test. Come on, slow down. Do a loop. Do another loop. Do another loop. Comes up, comes over, and dies. Oh, wait, I could afford that. Drive tires. I guess I can't afford drive. I can't do drive tires. That looks like it goes into the station way too fast. Okay, let's see it again now. So slow down time. So it does. Maintains more or less a decent speed. 20 miles an hour. I feel like we could do something in the middle. Like a flat ride of some sort might be interesting. Comes into the station at over 30 miles an hour. So, I s if we get rid of this, I'm curious. Let's ride it. Alright, see view. I'm gonna watch the test. Alright, let's go! So, you kinda just hang upside down here. I feature that on a lot of my rides. This one needs some music of some sort. Nice and smooth. Coming on down. Around. A lot of loops. He doesn't love loops though. And it comes on into the station. Got a high scenery rating in the end too. Yeah, scenery excitement, sorry. Uh, could have a better rating. The fear is a little bit on the high side. Uh, I wonder if we can mess with this. Probably can, to be honest. So if we spare up time. Let's see, where is everything a little bit low? <laughs> I know where. Right here at the top. Is there a better way we can deal with this? Alright, let's see. If we got rid of this, and maybe like, auto-completed it, what does it do? That might be a bit hellish, but let's see. Dive drops off the side. Okay, fear is definitely on the high side. That was even worse, so undo that. We can have more speed going into it, that would be a thing. Oh, I know. Take it from here and immediately shoot it up like that. Don't have a lot of money for this, per se. But, like, There, sort of. And do that. A little, little bit of a drop. We pick up some speed. Then we put in the loop again, which is, I think, a roll actually. So a dive drop, which I can't afford. It's putting out a weird spot too. Yeah, but I want to take it down a little bit more, like to there. And then we, then we try to put in the dive loop, right? It will have more speed and be more interesting. It'll be much more expensive, I think. We can just easily complete that up. All right, time, please, just give me money. All right, almost there. That's not enough. Come on, a little bit more. We're losing. Come on, don't lose money. Gain money. One of my rides broken down. No, I'm just losing money very quickly for some reason. Why am I losing so much money? <laughs> Come on. Why am I not gaining money? Why am I losing so much money? Alright, cool. Build that and just complete it up. That's simple enough. Could be a problem. Oh, it's going to be very expensive for some reason. Although I feel like this might be more entertaining as a lot of the factors kind of just go up there. Come on, just a little bit more. Probably like a hundred would do. 
Just give me the money. I don't want to pull out a loan. Wait, I can't afford that. Right now? No. Place that down. Which is that going to cost me? Well, I know it's insufficient funds. It's 115. We are very low on money. Come on, just bring a little bit in. Because it had like a group of 10 people come into the park and go on a ride. Yeah, like sandwiches or something. As soon as I can open this, money will no longer be a problem, theoretically. Stop testing. And then I just want to auto complete it out with $67. Sixty-seven dollars. Come on. It's really having a hard time just being a positive amount of money. Let's see, can I do anything to the staff? All right, you seem fine. So, do not increase your pay. Lower your pay. And I'm also gonna lower your pay to eight point eight five. Yes, I know it's incomplete. I haven't completed it yet. Sixty-seven dollars is all I need. Boom, it's complete. All right, so let's see if we go. We're gonna ride it. Be really fast time. All right, normal, normal speed. Ride it, and it'll be the end of the episode. Hopefully, the end of us working on the ride. I think, yeah, the ride is also at fourteen miles, at five miles an hour. I'm gonna quickly fix that because it should not be at five miles an hour. Be at, like. Yeah, 14. We'll restart the test. Get up to the top. Actually, I want to increase this entry, the exit speed. Start test. Flies out of the station, goes to the lift. Goes to the lift relatively quickly, actually. Alright, get near the top. Get on board. Ooh, I sped up time. Let it complete the test. It did worse. Ugh. You know what we're gonna undo? A lot. We're just gonna go back to what it was originally. Because that was fine. Let's see where the big scare factor is. Curiosity. I also want that to shoot out. Alright, let's watch where the big scare factor is. Alright. There it's pretty scary. Alright, I wasn't actually paying attention. But I think it's this corner, which would make sense. Alright, normal speed. It does this little loop thing. So right here is actually a big scare factor. So we could probably lower this. Not just ended everything I did. Alright, yeah, you're still 22. I wonder why that's so scary. Yeah. We'll add some turn breaks, see what happens. See if we can still do the ride. Do the rest of it, I guess. I mean, it's an interesting shape, especially right there. So you're off. It goes only about 50. So it's down. And it also can't seem to make that. I think the whole design of this is like a little bit weird. Maybe if we just completed it there, it'd be fine. So let's restart it. Oh, we're up to over a thousand now. Nifty. Get it to the top real quick. It should be coming down. Let's see how it does. That's even worse. Excitement seems to be there as well. I'm not sure. I think it might balance well, and I don't know. 
Oh, yeah, it's so much better. Okay, done. Perfect. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. It did go a little bit longer. I think I'll edit it down. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I didn't say rate this time. Um, yeah, uh, check me out in episode four when that comes out. Bye.